hey youtube what a day tommy i had a blast at the indy hot wheel club july celebration sort of like a convention uh this video is going to tell you about the hall at the end of this video i'll put a link to the show so let's go check out what we got we have like a little oscar meyer wiener plush toy feels like it's got beads in there I saw this Sherman Chang as I man so bad. I gotta get it for myself. So I picked that up for myself. And we have never seen these before. They're Matchbox Haunted Haulers. There we have the Ghoul Bus, Drag Bike, and Neck Wrecker. Uh, the guy that was selling them had all three, so we went ahead and bought all three. Uh, Here's a ghoul bus. Get it? School bus, ghoul bus. And it comes with these accessory skeletons. And look at that. Mr. Beware. So they put a lot of time and effort and thought and design into these. Here's Drank Bike. And in the comment section below, you tell me which one you like the best. And here's a neck wrecker. That is so cool. I love those records. Some guy had some Legos. Of course, if you know little Tommy, he loves Legos. I do too, but he really collects them, builds their shit. Here's another one. That's the original first version of uh, the Tuscan Raider. Some guy had a Hot Wheel Greyhound bus. You don't see these buses in anymore. This thing's heavy. This is solid. And it, it wouldn't be complete without the magnet guy. Uh, he cuts the Hot Wheels in half. This sticks on your refrigerator. Tommy got like a, sort of like a mismatch of these. Do a quick show through. And see the little doggy? Roof, roof. There's a Bel Air. 57. This looks like the Homer car. Homer Simpson's car. Station wagon. And I got this one for myself. I like the big rigs. Coke. Can't go wrong, wrong with Coke. And this one's just a single one. Here's the trucks. And this was a trade. That I had with uh, Jackson. You guys know him as High Wheels Nation. And I'll put a link there. You guys click on it. Check out his channel. The other video I'll have more video of him. But if you look. This one's backwards. Uh, it's supposed to be facing from left to right. But he picked this up at a store. Um, said it's available for Trey in one of his YouTube videos. I said, hey, I'm interested, and we worked out a deal at the show. He brought it to the show. And he also set up a little table, which in the other video you can check it out. But he had these mystery bags. Tommy wanted two of them. So we got the very first one, number one. And number two. And these were the mystery cars. Now, one of the bags, he said, was supposed to have a treasure hunt. Obviously, we didn't get it, so hopefully someone else got it. So, these are the mystery bags that we got. And here are some of the cars that Jackson had for sale. Close up these. And if you don't know, Tommy loves NASCAR, so when he saw that, he flipped. He's like, I gotta get them. Daddy, can I have it? And Jackson had great prices, so we, we got them. And Jackson, he knows that we love crushed cars. And we're going to use this in our ramp, downhill ramp, later on. And there's a Ford F-150. Here's a school bus. Now, what's so cool about this school bus, if you look closely, that is a perfect indent of a monster truck tire. Check that out. Yeah, let's see how it fits, see how it fits perfectly excellent job and if you don't know 
you think smashing cars are easy but sometimes it's hard just to keep the wheels on and as you can tell see but Tommy he don't care he loves he smash up cars because he plays with them you know in his monster truck shows. here's another one okay. and then another dealer had this one Tommy really wanted it and asked the dealer how much he quoted her price I said well honey if we get this you cannot mess it up damage it cause yeah. I mean, it wasn't a lot, but it wasn't for free, so pretty cool truck. And the dealer also had some these Hot Wheels. Check that out. It pops open. Had these other cars. Those are rubber tires. You can't tell in the video, but and some of these other ones. Tommy loves the older cars. I'm glad he does. You can't really beat a classic. And then Dave, our president, uh, was calling out kids' numbers, and Tommy's number got called up. And now looking at that box, he's like, "Oh, there's like one Hot Wheel or maybe some candy." But check it out, these little Lego guys. Uh, <laughs> cars in there look at that hot wheel car another car I mean what you can't beat all this stuff another car a little lantern that you can wear around your neck and uh, clip like IDEs or anything and then I saw this uh, Kenworth big rig I said I gotta get another one I love my big rigs so I'll probably customize that. And talking about customizing, they had a gentleman, and I regret not, not getting your name, uh, but the fella that made this, I got him on video. If you can message me what your name is, I'd love to add an annotation and give you credit for this beautiful artwork. If you look, it's like sparkly, multicolored. It is just gorgeous in real life. Hopefully the camera's picking it up and see how he uh, rethreaded or tabbed and put a screw in there. Okay. Now, <laughs> what's so cool? There was one of the dealers that watched my video, and I'll put a link somewhere around there. And I did mention the video, like, hey, there's only one guy that had monster trucks. Well, the guy watched the video and he said, I'm going to bring some monster trucks for Tom, F4 Collector. And sure enough, he did. Now, check it out. Wise guy. See those bullet holes? Really good condition. Green Chrome Gray Digger. You guys know the value of this truck? Crazy. Here we have Wild Thing. Now this is original, small hub, heavy as all get out. See the red bandana? See how he's looking crazy? And he also had a regular, that's metal base, but these are the big hub wheels. That's a bingo. I had this in like a car diversion. I really didn't want to open it. Now I don't have to. Jurassic Attack. Again, original. Here we had Time Flies. Now the body, it's pretty rough. But of course, his he said his son played with these. And the hubs, uh, they're pretty rough too. But it is very hard to find this casting for under five, ten bucks. So he charged three dollars per truck. I cannot believe it. Now this one I told him, you know, this one sells on eBay around five to ten bucks. I said, are you sure? He said, yep, three bucks. So I went ahead and got it. Here's Travis Pastrana, 199. Boy, I wish he came back to Monster Trucks. They did a pretty good job. I was jumping around 
but uh, here's his truck another one three bucks there's maximum destruction uh, closed in look at that it's a little dusty but if you look at this one it's mint I mean there's no scratches nothing it's perfect um, when I first bought out I was thinking about customizing it but now second thought I think I'm going to just keep it as is and then we got another Jurassic attack yeah, let's move on to this little play set he also had this car wash and we do not have this one so we saw it we asked how much I think he said two bucks I said so so we'll open that later and then this one gentleman had this NASCAR carrier truck holiday version see the Christmas lights on it yeah let me get it out of the box here we haven't put batteries in it yet but I'm pretty confident it will light up see the little light holes so. again coca-cola heavy-duty truck uh, I think it was 10 or 15 bucks not too expensive and then Tommy won this Bel Air Chevy Bel Air car remind you of the Avenger monster truck don't it okay now the downhill race which I'll put in the other video uh, Tommy pulled this car Hot Wheel Papa Willie uh, he lost on the first round this car does not go down the track fast at all whereas F1 racer does I mean I want three this was the one I picked or it's a random pick you reach your hand in a bag and you can't see what you're grabbing so it's random and this was my random drawing he won three one more race I would have been in the finals but wasn't meant to be so you guys tell me what you think of Valor Hall if you like it or don't or be sure to check out the other video okay I think you guys will really enjoy watching that the downhill sizzler uh, the people of the club our president Marge his wife uh, Dave and all the others so be sure to check that out let me know what you guys think okay you guys have a great evening now these cars we save them for keepsake so I usually autograph Tommy autographs and we date it Hot Wheels Club Celebration Let's see 716 16 There we go I want to sign the bubble your name And put the date 7 16 16. 7 16. Here I protected the card. Got another protecto. Here's this one. 0 to 10. What would you rate the show? Ten. Your stuff, your haul. Why would you rate it? Mm. Ten. Most particularly, what would you rate Jackson's customized, smashed up, crashed up cars? Zero to ten. I want to get all of them. Are they all there? Yeah, they're all there. Zero to ten. What would you rate? Not this? ten. Really? That good? No, actually eleven. Eleven? You like mm -hmm. them that much? Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, there you go, Jackson, like this for watching the, the video. He rates them a 11 out of 10. He likes the red school bus the best. I was telling the ones on YouTube how oh, that's a perfect fit for the monster truck tire. 
Yeah, I like smashes. Okay. See y'all later. Say bye. Bye.